The young and the rest of spoilers, Phyllis goes against Jack's orders, thinking that she would give everything to defeat Diane. She's already crossed the line. She can't let her do what she likes anymore. Phyllis doesn't need Jack's love. She doesn't. She needs her respect more. Phyllis never gave in to any opponent, but for Diane, she tried. But Diane was wrong a lot. Diane despises Phyllis and Summer. She thinks they are like parasites of the Abbott family. Without Jack and Kyle, they would not be alive. It was that insult that caused the love and marriage of their mother and daughter to officially fall apart. Phyllis has Grand Phoenix. Summer has a talent that many big corporations really need, and they don't need to cling to anyone. Diana was wrong to look down on the Phyllis family like that. Diane has too many haters. She takes advantage of the weaknesses of others to achieve her goals. Nikki, Phyllis, and Ashley will do whatever it takes to defeat Diane. Ashley finds Phyllis so poor, this woman has to endure many rejections from Diane to protect her daughter and herself. That's really not worth it. Diane is different. She has nothing to lose. She just wants to win. No matter how much everyone hates her, she doesn't care. Diane has her own personality, which is why Michael trusts and wants to work with her. Kyle, too. He trusted and always protected his mother from opponents. Ashlyn has been imprisoned. All the credit goes to Michael, but the most important person is Diane. She arranged the meeting of Harrison and Ashlyn by surprise. That happened. Diane texted Michael and the police arrested and jailed Ashlyn. Phyllis was angry and she couldn't keep her cool anymore. Diane would be careful with what she's doing.